Welcome to ITAMP. Uh, my name is Jim Babb, and um, I'm one of the members of the staff. Uh, Hossein is traveling, uh, so he's the director and not able to be here. But in case, uh, welcome. Uh, um, maybe you've been here for workshops before, but uh, we have a schedule, stuff's on the uh, web. Uh, if there's any changes, uh, the organizers will let you know. Um, ITAMP's uh, supported by the NSF and Smithsonian and Harvard and uh, been around for about 25 plus years and um, do a lot of activities. We have a long-term visitor program, short-term visitors, workshops, and a postdoctoral fellowship program. And all that information, if you're interested, you can find on our website, uh, including workshops that go way back. And uh, we also have a YouTube channel, which we're going to put this workshop, workshop on after it's done. Um, and so you'll be outfitted with a microphone, and it's also being webcast. So uh, hopefully that's all right. If you have any concerns, you can let me know. Um, or your organizers, Peter, Derek, and Peter. <laughs> and the other organizer's not here at the moment, but I'm sure he'll show up eventually, Misha Lukin. So uh, for that, turn it over to Peter. And oh, yeah, wireless you should be able to connect Harvard guests. Um, there's a better connection, the Harvard University connection, which you have to log into. There's a sheet in the back with that information if you're interested. If, if you don't have edge room or something, you can't get connected. But um, should be able to accommodate you. So uh, just find Naomi or Alice who stepped out for a moment. Naomi's in the back or myself. If you have any questions, or any of the postdocs can help too, presumably. And also people who were at ICAMP and have left. Of which there's more. So, okay. <laughs> Peter. Thanks, Jim. <laughs> okay, so I also want to say a few words. Uh, first of all, welcome from the organizers. So, um, as, you, as you know, so this is Peter uh, Lodal, <coughs> Derek Chang, uh, my name is Peter Rabe, and um, Misha Lukin is uh, also part of the organizing uh, committee, but not around yet. Um, so, uh, thanks for all of you for coming. I think it's really very uh, pleasant experiment as a experience as an organizer. If you send out the invitation and everybody replies that they want to come and are able to come. So we had only a very few cancellations, so that's always a good sign. Um, so a few words made about the topic. So the, the topic in general is kind of atom light interactions or uh, light matter interactions in one dimensions. And this kind of has, uh, so the idea for, the uh, for this uh, workshop came kind of last year in, in Benaz when we kind of, you know, few of us were together. Uh, I mean, some of us have been working on 1D systems, different type of atoms, couple to 1D waveguides, uh, superconducting qubits, couple to superconducting waveguides, and you know, quantum dots, a uh, couple of waveguides. And it kind of felt that, you know, there are a lot of people and now a lot of experimental platforms which kind of try to investigate the same type of interaction. So, but at the same time, I mean, it's, it's still kind of quite distinct. Some people work in the optical domain, some in the microwave domain, some people work with phonons, but there's kind of an, an overall theme about this, how kind of quantum emitters, the detection of quantum emitters gets modified if instead of we emit photons into three dimensions, we emit into one dimensional waveguide, the photons, you know, they cannot, cannot escape, they go along one direction infinitely. So we have all these nice effects of infinite range interactions we have a lot of new physics that comes, that comes about once we study these new type of systems, which are now available in different experiments. <laughs> and I think the idea is really kind of to, to bring here, you know, I would say, uh, first type of these, these, these workshops. At least I'm not aware about that this topic really has been addressed anywhere else, uh, this topic of a workshop. So the idea is really kind of to, to form a community, to talk to each other, to see what can different uh, experimental approaches do, what, what, uh, what are they good at, what can they uh, not do. And also from the theory part, I mean, uh, there are different theoretical approaches to uh, address these, these topics. And I think also on the theory part, uh, to kind of converge, maybe uh, here from kind of more solid state approaches, uh, and then from that better approaches, from optical approaches, and from, uh, <coughs> converge to kind of common understanding. Okay, so with this, uh, that's about kind of the, the workshop. Uh, one more thing. Um, so we have, in principle here, these walls. We can put up posters. So we have, don't have a specific poster session, but if somebody has bought a poster or for the local people that want to show some work, 
you just grab for at least tomorrow, put your post out there and have it there for the rest of the workshop. And then there was one um, announcement about today's talk from Elena Vukovic in the afternoon. So unfortunately she couldn't come, but she has sent a replacement. So Kai Müller is in the back and she will, uh, he will speak for uh, Elena and present uh, her work on, on, or their work on quantum dots and uh, strong coupling effects. Okay, with this, um, I would like to start the, the workshop. So once again, um, the organizing, so we only kind of were responsible for inviting people. Uh, the main organization here is done by Naomi Levy, she's, she's in the back, and every kind of uh, problems you have, uh, please, <laughs> or first contact, <laughs> contact me or the organizers we are referring to there because I think all the kind of the, the local organization is really done here by the item and people we are very grateful for that. 